This video is for the agriculture enthusiast. Whether you are a farmer, you are an agriculturist, you are an agriculture student, or plantito, plantita, this video is for you. Hello mga master, kamusta? For those people who don't know me yet, let me introduce myself first. My profession is an agriculturist and I work as an instructor in one of the universities here in Lakeland. Our topic today is about fertilizer computation. But before that, disclaimer lang po, I will just discuss based on my knowledge on this topic. Based on what are my understandings about this topic. So our topic today is about fertilizer computation. But before anything else, we will just first define some terms to be used in this discussion. First, we have fertilizer. Fertilizer is any material or any substance. It's either organic or inorganic that contains nutrients that is applied to the soil in order for the plants to grow well. And what is nutrient? Nutrient is an essential element that is needed by our plants in order to make their own food through photosynthesis and in order to grow. Another we have this single fertilizer. A single fertilizer is a type of fertilizer that contains only one nutrient. See for example, urea. Urea contains nitrogen only. Solophose, it contains phosphorus only. And for moiety of putas, it contains phosphorus only. So that is single fertilizer. It contains only one nutrient. Another we have this mixed fertilizer. A mixed fertilizer is a fertilizer that contains two or more nutrients. Say for example, ammonium phosphate. Ammonium phosphate contains about 16% of nitrogen and 20% of phosphorus. So that is a mixed fertilizer. Another we have this complete fertilizer. A complete fertilizer contains three nutrients. The nitrogen, the phosphorus, and potassium. So these three nutrients are primary macronutrients required by our plants. So since these are the three nutrients that is needed by our plants in a large amount. That is complete fertilizer. So when we say complete fertilizer, it contains these three nutrients. Take note for that. Another we have this fertilizer grade. A fertilizer grade is the percentage of a nutrient that is found in a fertilizer. So for example, urea. We have this 45 or 46 percent of nitrogen out of this one sack of urea. Okay, so that is fertilizer grade. The amount or the percentage of nutrients found in a fertilizer material. Another, we have this recommended rate. A recommended rate is the amount of nutrients that you should apply in your soil. Why it is recommended? Because it is the amount that is recommended by the experts. So for example, an agriculturist will tell you, you should apply this amount. That is recommended rate. That's why the term is recommended rate. Because it is a recommendation from an expert or an agriculturist. So basically, the unit of the recommendation from our experts or agriculturists is amount of nutrient per specific area basis. Say for example, they will recommend that 
you should apply 90 kilograms of nitrogen, 60 kilograms of phosphorus, and 30 kilograms of potassium per hectare. So that is the basic unit for a recommended rate. Amount of nutrient per hectare. So take note on that. Now, we will discuss about how to compute fertilizer. The question is, why we should compute fertilizer requirement for the plant? We will compute the fertilizer that is required by our plant so that we can apply the optimum level, the exact amount that is really needed by our plants. Since if we will apply lesser, so our plants will be stunted. The growth will be stunted. Another is if we apply excessive amount, it's a waste of materials. It's a waste of fertilizer. It's a waste also of money. Since the excess fertilizers will not be used by our plants. Since plants only absorb nutrients that they require. The same sa ating mga tao. Kung ano lang kaya natin kainin, yun, yun lang yung kinakain natin, di ba? So, go back to our topic. So guys, in computing fertilizer requirement for our plants, we should take note of these two questions. First is, how much fertilizer that I apply? Or, and how much nutrient that I apply? So those are the two basic questions that should be answered on this topic. Okay? So we have a formula to answer these questions. First, we will focus on how much fertilizer that I apply. So this is the formula on that. Weight of fertilizer is equal to recommended rate or weight of nutrients divided by percent nutrient times 100 percent. So this is the formula in computing how much fertilizer that I apply. The second formula is how much, the second question is how much nutrient diet? How much, the second, the second question is how much nutrients, the second question is how much nutrient that I apply? So this is the formula in answering that particular question. Weight of nutrient is equal to weight of fertilizer times percent nutrient. 